What's going on, his squad? It's your main man, Hitman, and I am back once again with the daily spawn updates for Red Dead Online. This is for the family heirlooms, all lost jewelry, the coins, the arrowheads, the flowers, the antique alcohol bottles, all tarot cards, the bird eggs, and the fossils. Today is Wednesday, I'm thinking. Uh, I'm not sure. It's Wednesday, November 10th, and as I say each and every video, Make sure you guys like, share, subscribe, turn on all post notifications so you guys can get each and every video that I put out because I put out videos each and every day. While I was doing this video, while I was prepping for the video, um, going to see Madame Nazar, all that stuff, so she appeared on the map. Uh, I ran into a guy in God mode, for what I presume. I'm going to post that video after this video, maybe a couple of hours after or whatever. But... He was in God mode. I shot him a couple times with the uh, explosive rounds from a shotgun because that's what I had on me. <laughs> and he did not die. I, I shot him 10 times and then I continued to shoot him. And he um, he didn't die or anything. I, I, I wasn't a fan of that. So I fast traveled out of there. I, got, I had to get out the situation because you wasn't about to punk me. Or I mean for less of a word. <laughs> He wasn't about to treat me like I wasn't nothing. Because, I mean, he was about to do it. He was about to just take it from me. Anywho, let's get back to this video. <laughs> First thing, as always, I want to get to is Madame Nazar's location. Which, today, she's up here in Big Valley. Right by the word Little Creek River. Or right by Little Creek River. Wallace Station area. Um, up in the upper part of Big Valley. She's right here at this location and she will be here until 1 a.m. Since the time change, the times for Madame Nazar and the cycles change. The cycles change is 7 Eastern Standard Time and Madame Nazar changes at 1 Eastern Standard Time. Um, she will be here uh, until 1 a.m. like I said. And how I personally get to her when she's up in this area is I move my camp up here. And I try to make sure I'm somewhere up closer towards this side of the map because if you're down here the camp will spawn down here so if you do move your camp try to make sure you're up towards valentine area so make sure you're up closer towards this part of the map because if you're like down in roads and you try to move your camp to big valley it might put it down here somewhere so i mean that's just a hint in another way uh you can just simply fast travel to strawberry and take the side route do not go through the mountain because it'll take forever and it's too much stress just to go to the upper part of big valley so take the side roads uh, around the mountain and it'll be a lot more easier and quicker uh the next thing i want to get to is the caribbean rum antique alcohol bottle which that is in the uh chola springs area right outside of armadillo is right here between the word i mean in the word springs between the r and i of springs right here at this location there's a tent and directly in front of that tent on the ground that's where you will find your antique alcohol bottle your caribbean rum antique alcohol bottle for today there's also a couple things inside of armadillo i want to tell you guys about real real quick Inside this saloon, on a side table near the couches on the top floor of the saloon, there is a ivory comb that is a family heirloom. Uh, about right here, there's a random lost jewelry right here at this location. So come over here with your metal detector and that's what you will dig up. And there's also a tarot card over here near this circle, right about here. There's a coffin and in, inside that coffin next to this circle, which is a mass grave, you guys will get a two of pentacles if you want to go over there and grab that while you're getting that Caribbean rum antique alcohol bottle. Let's go over here to where we normally do business, which is the Lemoyne area of the map. I'm going to try to put, well, try to put in most of the stuff, but not everything makes it. <laughs> The cycles for today, Wednesday, November 10th, 
are Family Heirloom Cycle 2, All Lost Jury Cycle 3, Coin Cycle 2, Arrowhead Cycle 5, Wildflower Cycle 1, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 2, All Terror Card Cycle 1, Bird Egg Cycle 6, and Fossils Cycle 3. Remember to check the description box below because everything will be down there for you guys. The cycles, a link to a video for the current cycle of fossils and how to spell the Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and Cash App for the channel. Everything will be down there for you guys. Let's get to what we will find inside these markers that I did mark um, on today's journey for the next 24 hours or so, 23 hours or so. <laughs> at the making of this video because who knows when you'll watch it uh let's get to the first marker which is kind of up a little bit matter of fact we're going to go above that right about here above this triangle right above that triangle there's a wagon right about here right here at this location at the back of the wagon on the ground you guys will get an antique alcohol bottle with is which is a grand core zone Go right here to this lo location and you should be able to pick it up. Let's go down to our first marker, which is a random fossil. I cannot tell you guys what fossil this is because it is randomized. Come over here with your metal detector in this area and that's what you will dig up a random fossil. Let's go down to our next marker, which is by the H of Marsh. Right here at this location, underneath this house, this is a stilt house. Go underneath the stilts or underneath the actual house. Pull out your metal detector and you guys will get a random coin. I cannot tell you what it is because, once again, it's randomized. Let's go over a little bit to our next marker. There's a couple things over here in this area I want to tell you guys about today. Right here at the marker, there's a family nothing. There's a lost jury. Right here at this location, which is a Kalumet turquoise earring. This Kalumet turquoise earring is sitting on the ground underneath the window next to a barrel in the crack of, you know, the house. So you have to reach down and grab it. You have to approach it and then your character will reach down and grab it. Uh, next to that, there's a boat. On the back of that boat, you guys will get a tarot card. This tarot card is on a barrel. And it's a Queen of Wands. There's also a tarot card right about here on a gravestone. This tarot card is a Seven of Wands. Let's go down to our next marker, which is right below the word Le Gras. Right here at this location on this island. Pull out your metal detector and you guys will hit on a random arrowhead. I cannot tell you which one you grab. You will get or grab but that's what it is right here at this location if you do want to go grab that over here on this other island right here i'm sorry for bouncing around <laughs> inside this old abandoned convenience store on the counter you guys will see a old time gin antique alcohol bottle if you want to go in there and grab that as well uh there's a tarot card here i cannot remember which one it is i think it's right here and like this little storeroom area. I cannot remember which one that is, but this next marker right here is a bird egg. Right here at this location in a tree, there's a bird's nest and that bird egg is a egret egg, E-G-R-E-T. It's in a tree, shoot it down with a varmint rifle or a bow using a small game arrow. Let's go over to the grave site or uh, cemetery. Right here inside the cemetery, you guys will get a antique alcohol bottle, which is a absinthe bottle. That's A-B-S-I-N-T-H-E. It's right here in this little mausoleum right here at this location. Go straight through the gate and towards the back where there's a shelf. And on that shelf, that's where your antique alcohol bottle will be. Let's go on to our next um, marker, which is inside the saloon enter the saloon go up to the second floor and enter the only bedroom that you can enter and in front of the bed there's a stand a, a washing stand a wash stand or a shaving stand or whatever they call it 
on that shaving stand or wash stand, you guys will see a cherry wood comb. This cherry wood comb is a family heirloom. So grab that and jump off the balcony. <laughs> That's what I usually do. I go through through the door and jump off the balcony. It may hurt the character a little bit, but you you survive it. Let's go over here to our next marker, which is above the Eye of Saint, right here at this location. Right across the street, at this location, you guys will see a table. This is a white table, and on that table, there's a chessboard. On that chessboard, you will see a tarot card, which is a Eight of Swords, so grab that as well. There's also another item right here by the S of Saint. Go in this backyard of this mansion or house, it's a, it's a very large house. And right here at this location, on the couch of this back porch or deck, you guys will see a ebony hairbrush sitting on the couch. So go and grab that. This, family, this ebony hairbrush, which is, it is a family heirloom. In the, what is this? This is a, uh, I want to call it a sewage area. This is the sewage area over here. And this item is a fossil so come over here with your metal detector and that's what you will dig up a random fossil but this item is a lost jury this lost jury is over here in the trash area that's what we're going to call it because i cannot think of the correct word i'm drawing a blank but right here in this location in a pile of trash come over here with your metal detector in about this area um pull out your metal detector and that's what you will dig up a random lost jury let's go over to our next marker which is the cardinal flower that spawns over here in this area each and every day and by its exact location it tells me exactly what cycle the flowers are on for today and today is cycle one um there's also a random item over here if you guys want to go grab that uh you don't need your metal detector but you do need a shovel and inside this building there's another antique alcohol bottle, which is about right here inside the building. At the edge of an overturned barrel, you guys will get a cognac antique alcohol bottle right here at this location. Let's go over to, I wouldn't say the Braithwaite Manor, but the, the field, the grounds of the Braithwaite Manor, right here inside this square. You guys will get a family heirloom. This family heirloom is a rosewood hairbrush. And this rosewood hairbrush is on the nightstand in the corner. So go and grab that. There's also a tarot card inside the Braithwaite Manor home. I cannot remember which one it is. I think it's a Ace of Wands. If you guys want to go grab that. But let's get up here to Rose, which there's nothing really inside of Rose but tarot cards. There's a couple tarot cards inside this actual little city area right here. Um, the first one is right here at this location. Go up the stairs and there's a, a table and a rocking chair. Right on that table, you guys will see a King of Cups tarot card. So go and grab that. Um, right here on, at this house. On the bench, you guys will get a Two of Wands tarot card. And right across from Rhodes, there's a table with a bucket of water next to it or on it. And next to that bucket of water, you guys will see a Ten of Cups tarot card. Uh, I have a couple more things for you before I get to this last marker that's right over here. We're going to swoop around right here by this little mark. There's a log. And right next to that log... You guys pull out your metal detector and you will get a random lost jury. I cannot tell you what it is because it is randomized. Go up here to this house and you will get another item, which is a tortoise shell comb. This tortoise shell comb is in the house on the dresser with the mirror. There's two bedrooms. One of them have a dresser with a mirror on it. And to our next and last marker, you guys will get a coin. This coin is randomized. I cannot tell you what it is. But the location of it is underneath the railroad. Come over here underneath the railroad. That's why I kind of put it over to the little to the right a little and not directly in the middle. Come over here to this location underneath the bridge or underneath the railroad. 
and pull out your metal detector and that's what you will hit on a random coin as i said i cannot tell you what it is because it is randomized but that's pretty much it for everything that i do have for you guys the cycles for today once again are Family Heirloom Cycle 2, All Laws Jury Cycle 3, Coin Cycle 2, Arrowhead Cycle 5, Wildflower Cycle 1, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 2, Altair Card Cycle 1, Bird Egg Cycle 6, and Fossils Cycle 3. <laughs> Remember to check the description box below because everything will be down there the cycles a link to a video for the current cycle of fossils and how to spell um the the name of the twitter instagram facebook and cash out for the channel thank you guys for watching looking listening liking sharing subscribing commenting and everything else you do for the channel because i do appreciate it so so much any type of inter interaction with the channel helps me build it it helps me helps put me out there to people that watches this type of content and stuff like that um as i said i will be back with i won't be back but i will post the other video of the guy in god mode which that's kind of weird like why would you do that on a video game i mean you know, i mean a, a video game like this you spend that much time on this video game i thought the game was dying like people actually doing stuff like that but um it's the main hit man as i said once again with another video Thank you guys for watching, and I'm out.